Um, I voted for Scott Walker, and basically because I'm in a big fan of the Foxconn um, acquisition or whatever you would call it. Um, I heard that some of the Democratic nominees would have tried to shoot it down, and so that was a big deal in my vote. I, I feel like Scott Walker's performance has affected my vote, not n not the other way around. I voted for Tony Evers because I kind of don't like where Scott Walker's been going and taking things. I don't like the Foxconn deal, so I kind of want money to go back into the schools. Some of the bigger stuff, I don't like the rhetoric that the bigger government is doing right now, so I kind of for voting for Congress, I kind of voted against against the president's party that way. I would consider myself a conservative, not really a big fan of Trump, but um, so I, I would say he kind of pushed me away maybe more from the Republican Party than I normally would. I don't really like how they're treating immigration. I feel like it's just kind of this demonizing of people coming across the border. And uh, I voted for uh, Tony Evers for governor because I've worked with him throughout the, uh, my time as being an educator and I like a lot of the things that he stands for. For our state, I think education, of course, is big for me. Um, how are we going to continue to um, improve our schools, improve the experience of all our kids? I don't follow. I follow it, but I kind of don't follow it. I just think it's a choice that people made, and we, as a, a country, got to live with it. And if we want change, then we got to get out and vote.